Guys, in this video, you will learn how you can share the total number of followers that you have on Twitter on other social media accounts like Facebook or Instagram automatically. So guys, for this, we are going to integrate Social Blade application as the trigger of the workflow, which is going to get the statistics of your Twitter followers. And after that, it is going to share the number of followers on Facebook and Instagram automatically. And guys, you can uh, schedule the running of this workflow at any given date or any, at any given time in the future as well. And we are going to set up this automation without any coding super easily. So let's begin. To set up this automation, we are using Pabli Connect, which is an automation tool. And this is the landing page of Pabli. And I have pasted the same link in the description as well. So guys, from the given link, you can set up your free Pabli Connect account and you will get free automation tasks every month to set up your automations. Okay. So guys, from the given link, you can just sign up right now. And after that, you have to sign in and you will reach the dashboard of Pabli Connect. And from here, guys, you have to click on this create workflow button to set up the automation workflow. And here you can give a name to your workflow as well. So I'm giving the name here. So here I have given the name share Twitter followers data and social media. So after giving the name, just click on create button and you can see the workflow page is loading up here and on this page you will find these two modules the trigger and the action so our automations are based on these two things so the trigger is that event which is going to start this workflow and the action would be the consequence or the response towards the trigger so in our use case guys we are going to schedule the running of this workflow at a definite time in future and after that we are going to fetch the details of twitter statistics and that will be the action steps okay so here in the Twitter, in the trigger section, we are going to use scheduler feature of Pabli. So with the help of scheduler, you can schedule the running of your workflow. So here you can see it is asking how often you want to run your workflow. So we have many options here. You can select at regular intervals. So you can select any regular intervals of time like every hour or in a, at every 15 days and so on. And here we have once options. So you can schedule it once. You can schedule it every day. You can select any day of the week or any date of the month as well. So I'm selecting days of the week option here. And I want that at every week on Sunday or let's say Saturday, my Twitter follower stats should be shared on other social media platforms. Okay. So here I'm selecting the day as Monday. Okay. And the time. So you can select the time of the running of this workflow as well. So I'm selecting the time as let's say 9 a.m. Okay. Right. Now click on save and your workflow will be scheduled like this. Okay. After that, we have this action step. So uh, when this workflow triggers at this date and time, we want that the statistics of our Twitter account will be fetched. For that, we are using social blade application, which is an analytical tool for social media. Okay. And here the action event we are going to use is this get statistics. Okay. So click on connect here. From here, select add new connection and here it will ask for the client ID and the access token of social blade application. So you just have to click here on this client ID word, just right click on it and then click and then open this link in a new tab. Okay. So it will bring you to this API dashboard of social blade. So you have to open this client ID like this. You have to copy it and you have to paste it here like this. Similarly, do for access token, open this link in a new tab as well. And this is the access token. You can just open it and copy it and paste it here. Okay, then click on save and you will be connected with social blade. Okay. And here it is asking for the platform's name. So here you can see from YouTube, you can fetch the stats from Twitter, Twitch, TikTok, DLive, Facebook and Instagram. Right now I want the statistics of Twitter. So I'm selecting Twitter here. And in the query field, you have to enter your account's name of Twitter. So right now we are not using paid version of social blade. So it will give me only social rates, its own statistics only. Okay. So I'm just going to put here social blade, but if you're using paid account of social blade, you can enter your Twitter handles name and it will bring you the stats right now. I'm just showing you the demo. So I'm putting social blade only here. Okay. And here click on save and send test request button and you will receive the stats 
real quickly like this okay so here you can see it is showing you the details of the username you can see username is social blade the location of the account the date of creation of the account and when you scroll down you will get the total followers data here and the total followings data is here total tweets is here and you can see the growth of followers um, this is the last day growth this is the last three days growth last seven days and so on if you have many statistics here right so after getting the statistics i want to share this on instagram and on facebook so click here on this plus icon and here in the section step i'm going to search for facebook and i'm going to select facebook pages so i want to share the stats on my facebook page so i'm selecting pages and the action event would be create page post select create page post option then click on connect and from here select add new connection then click on connect with connect with facebook and it might bring you to the login window but i have already logged in on facebook so it will just ask me to continue like this and you can see the authorization is successful and we are connected all right and here it is asking for the page's name so the name of my page is this you can see pably is my page okay so i'm going to select this name from the workflow from this list okay and it will give you a page access token like this and here it is asking for the message that you want to post so here i'm just going to show you the demo so i'm writing as twitter account twitter handle update okay and here i am going to put total followers okay and after that i am writing total followers and after that i am going to map this label here in which i have received the data of the total followers from social blade and i am going to map this label here and to map it you just have to click here after this word okay and the previous steps will appear here in the drop down and from the second step just map this label which is showing you the total followers okay right and if you are sending any link you can paste the link here but right now i'm leaving this blank now you can check your connection with facebook by clicking on save and send test request button and guys when you map this label here whenever this workflow is going to run as per your schedule like this it is going to run every week on monday this label is going to be updated according to the data social blade is going to fetch okay and it will always show you the fresh data of fresh statistics okay now let's check our connection this is our page let me click on save and send test request here and a test post will be created on my facebook page you can see we got this id created let me show you the page now let me refresh the page and here you can see guys a new post is created here just now it is showing us twitter handle update total followers this is the data and this is the same thing i have mapped here you can see okay so this is how it is going to work similarly just click here on this plus icon and now we can share the stats on instagram as well okay so i'm selecting instagram for business and the action event would be so instagram is a video and a photo sharing platform so we have these action steps here action events here so i'm going to select this publish photo option okay then click on connect and from here select add new connection then click on connect with instagram for business and it will be connected so if you're not logged in it will bring you to the login window but i have a log already logged in here it will got it, it just got connected like this okay right and here it is asking which account you are using so you have to select your account's name my account's name is this joe and it got selected here here it is asking for the photo url so guys in this step in the social blade step you can see we have received some media as well so we have received the logo of uh, the social blade application okay so it is showing you the logo if you have your personal handle of on twitter it will bring you your profile image here in this branding avatar uh, label and we can map this branding avatar label here for sharing on instagram okay so i'm going to map this label here in the photo url field from the social blade step you can see the branding avatar is here okay and in the caption i'm going to place the data that we have received so 
I am writing here the same Twitter account update and I am going to place total followers and I am going to map the total followers label from the social blade step here is the total followers okay so if you want to share any other thing you can use this data that you have received from social blade and share it by mapping the labels okay for example if you want to share the daily account update you can select this label and it will show you the uh, growth of the last day okay right now you can check the connection with instagram i am clicking on save and send test request here and a new test post will be created on instagram here you can see we have received this these ids let me show you now on instagram i am refreshing my profile here and here you can see we got this new post created so you can see this is the logo or the profile image of social blade and here you can see the caption twitter account update total followers this is how you can share the data on instagram okay so we are done setting up this automation and you have to set up it only once after that you don't have to do anything manually in this workflow after that according to your schedule it is going to work automatically and share the stats on your social media accounts automatically and guys you can use this workflow as well because i'm going to paste the link of this workflow in the description and you can clone it in your own free pably connect account and start using this automation instantly guys thank you so much for watching our video and please please let us know how our automation ideas are helping you in the comment section and if you have any queries related to this application please ask your queries from this forum link and do check the pricing of this application from this link and guys we are open to ideas if you want us that we should make videos on other aspects of your business please do let us know in the comment section and if you like our work please subscribe to our channel